امشب ما در یک گروپ از خانمایی که هستیم ما حتی گفتیم برابر یک چادر ما جای آن باشه ما از وطن خود باید دفاع کنیم ما خودم به طفل دارم دو طفل خود قربانی از وطن میکنم خود قربانی از وطن میکنم وقتی اینقدر جوانای ما شهید شده ما چرا شهید نشم ما چرا برای وطن چی از اینکه سبا روز دیگه جوانا به می حالت ما دچ از اینکه دچار شده ما بهتر است که امروز مظاهره کنیم امروز قیام ملی کنیم ما چیز ممروز بسته کردیم پس اونا خود تان ببینید که خانمی که چندین جای کار میکرد امروز در خانه شیشته پس مثل ما واری چقدر خانم های دیگر در خانه است ما تقریبا پانزه فامیل هم رای ما کار میکردن تنها در یک بخش کار میکردن اونا پانزه فامیل ما روز پنج شنبه ما همیشون جواب دادم اونا کشون در خانه شده Tuesday was the day uh, with uh, the biggest demonstration against uh, the Taliban under their rule in the last uh, three weeks. Uh, Wednesday, we heard some uh, voices and slogans on different parts of the country uh, with some casualties and some beatings. Uh, videos uh, surfaced on social media and shared by activists and members of the protests that the Taliban have been um, um, beating some of the protesters, especially women, and uh, lashing them. Um, uh, in part one, we heard uh, news about uh, some casualties, numbers still unclear. Um, uh, there were uh, uh, reports that some people uh, were killed during the protests. Uh, journalists reported that uh, it was pretty violent. <laughs> Well, I think that's what uh, we see the, the changes in the last 20 years we had in Afghanistan. The achievements uh, the Afghan women were talking about, we see it on the streets of Kabul when they're brave enough to go and stand in front of the Taliban and, and, and ask for their rights. Um, my understanding is that uh, they do risk their lives in many cases. They, they, they do risk uh, being uh, prosecuted later on, um, but they still brave enough. They, they still uh, brave to go to the streets uh, and, and, and chant slogans and, and, and seek uh, their rights. Oh, 